What's poppin' air gunners? I'm Denny, the flat broke air gunner. I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Today, I want to talk about the Gamo Swarm Whisper 10X in 177. The Whisper is a brake barrel repeater that has a 10 shot magazine in 177 cal and requires 30 pounds of cocking effort uh, with a reported max velocity of 1300 feet per second. Again, that's in 177 because the Whisper also comes in 22 cal and has a th synthetic black ambidextrous Monte Carlo style stock. According to the info I found online, the Whisper stock is filled with automotive grade glass, whatever that means. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, the stock has a really nice rubber butt plate that shoulders well. It's called the Shockwave Absorber Recoil Pad. It's got a nice texture and everything. Uh, the whole rifle has nice texturing and stippling on the grip and the foregrip. The Whisper has an overall length of 45.3 inches with a rifled barrel, which is 19.9 inches in full length. And the rifle weighs in at 5.64 pounds. The Whisper comes with 11 millimeter dovetail grooves on a recoil reducing rail, along with the Gamo provided 3x9x40 scope. It has uh, really fine crosshairs. There's no uh, you know dots or anything like that. It's just straight lines. The Whisper has neither a front nor rear sight and is powered by a gas piston and it has the IGT inert gas technology setup. It has a two-stage trigger that's independently adjustable custom action trigger. It's pretty smooth. The Whisper has a manual safety that's located directly in front of the trigger, so it's really simple and easy to function. The trigger pull requires 3.2 pounds of effort. The barrel is shrouded and silenced. As the decibel testing shows, it's definitely backyard friendly. Running around $165 here in the state, it's a great little plinker or paper puncher. I probably wouldn't do any pesting with it or hunting with it, but that's just me. If you're a better shot, maybe it'll all work out. The, def the, whis the Whisper is definitely fun and affordable. Let's uh, take a look and go over the magazine and load it up, and then we'll take a few shots so you can see her in all her glory. Okay, the uh, magazine is released. It's right here. There's a little button right there. You push the button and then pull it up. It comes right out. You have to load it from the backside, which is facing the gun. And there's numbers on the top. So as you feed it, or as you shoot it, the numbers will drop down and go to the warning sign. So you know that not to dry fire the gun. So let's load it up, and uh, we'll put some shots through. I'm shooting some crossmen. Uh, I'm not even sure which ones they are. Destroyers. Crossmen destroyers. For some reason, this gun really seems to like those pellets. So, and... Who am I to argue? They're easy to come by. You can get them at Walmart and stuff like that. There's no real shortage of these pellets like there is uh, the 30 cals that are going on. So you just put the pellet in the little hole. You got to rotate it, and then you have to hold it manually and put the pellet in. It won't go back once the pellet is in there. So you got to work your way through and through. Takes a little time, but if you have multiple magazines, this will save all kinds of time when you're shooting because you just get, load them all up before you even go out to the range or to the farm or wherever you're going to do your pesting. And it's just breaking the barrel and it, it loads itself. It's really, it took me a little time to get used to it because I'm used to feeding every single shot when you break the barrel. And having this, I kept reaching for the pellets and reaching up. So here we go. We'll take, you got to put the magazine back in. That's the back of it, so it'll face towards you. Put it in like that. Break it down. And here we go.
There you go, Air Gunners. It's the Gamo Swarm Whisper in 10X. As you can see, it's it's pretty on point. Uh, it's a lot of fun to shoot. I really like the fact, again, that you just break the barrel and go right into the next shot. So, uh, again, 165 bucks here in the States. If you're thinking about getting one, hopefully this little video will help nudge you in that direction. Uh, I want to thank you very much for watching. Not only does your viewership, but your friendship truly means a lot to me. Always be a straight shooter. Always wear your shooting glasses when you're shooting. Stay flat broke for life, people. Take care. God bless. Thank <laughs> you.